I made a program that uses ChatGPT to automatically make programs and edit them until they work. It's not perfect yet, just like ChatGPT, but it's pretty dang good for creating small functions. Not for, you know, dealing with a whole code base, but if you just want to make a small function to add into your code, yeah, it's perfect for that. It can uh, edit lines individually or just regenerate the whole code. That's your choice in the options. There's a few other options, but yeah, it's coming along. Here's an introduction to this awesome system. You can download the code from GitHub. Go ahead and run the script. We're gonna tell it to do motion detection and outline the motion with red lines. Now we can choose to generate new code or edit an existing file. We're gonna generate new code. And then pinpoint individual line slash section editing or regenerate the whole code. We're just gonna regenerate the whole code each edit. And now choose between full auto coding or chat coding. Chat coding, you can talk to it each loop. And then you can choose to have a timeout or not when you're executing the script. We're gonna use one. And now it'll create some new code, test it, and see what happens. It worked first try that time, so we're gonna go ahead and close out of this and save the file to a new file name. Now let's say you wanna modify existing code. Well, let's do that. We're gonna make this show the last five outlines as blue lines on the image. And then we're gonna choose to edit an existing file instead of generating new code. The pinpoint editing is still a little bit buggy, so we're just gonna go with whole code regeneration for this video. And now you give it the file name. We're gonna do chat coding. And then we're gonna have a timeout on the script running. And here we go. Well, that's not quite right. There's a blue outline, but there's not five of them. And why are the lines staying in one spot when I move away? It's weird. Huh? Same, same thing. Same thing on this one. Okay. And same thing again. It keeps saving the lines from like the initial location. So now we've done enough edits to start over because that wasn't working, so it regenerate, it's doing the edits from scratch, and it worked this time. And now just to confirm that the script is actually good, let's open it up in the console window and execute it again, outside of the autocoder script. Yeah, I'd say that's working good, cool. Function former by making made easy. All of the code for this is available for free on our GitHub. The only thing you have to pay for is the API usage through OpenAI. And it sure would be cool if you'd join the Making Made Easy Patreon. Join the Patreon!